Hello everyone, I welcome you to my channel. Today I am going to show you how to install the latest version of Android Studio that is Android Studio Flamingo version on the Windows operating system. And after that I am also going to show you how you can easily create a simple Android project on our Android Studio and how you can easily run that on our Android phone. So do watch the video till the end. If you face any issues in middle you can put a comment in our comment section. I am always there to help you. And if you like the video then please give it a like and please do subscribe and please also do share with your friends that will really help me to make more such videos. So let's begin. Now to install Android Studio you need to first simply go to favorite browser and in the address bar just simply search with Android Studio download and hit enter. And it's going to show you this developer.androidstudio.com. So here you need to just simply click on this download Android Studio. And when you click on that, it's going to redirect to the official site of this android.com. So here you can see we have this big download button to download the Android Studio Flamingo version. So just simply click on this link and uh, it's going to ask you for these terms and conditions. So you can read this uh, and at the end, you'll get this check button that is I have read uh, and agreed with the condition. Click on this download button. And there you go. You can see our Android Studio rightly started downloading. Now I have already downloaded it, so I'll just simply cancel it. I minimize my browser. I'll go to my download directory, and here you can see the latest version of Android Studio is already been downloaded over here. And the file size is 987 MB. So now to install Android Studio, just simply double click on the you know installer and it will ask you for administrative privileges just simply click on yes and uh, you can minimize your download directory and you can see our uh, welcome to android studio installation setup wizard is rightly open so let's click on next so here it is asking whether you'd like to also install android virtual device so here i'm going to recommend you to uncheck this so no, why we uncheck this because you have probably your android phone right so on that android phone itself we can install this android app that you are building and you can you know run and test right there you don't need any virtual device that will unnecessarily going to you know create more space and make your system slow so you don't need to check this so just simply uh, you know uncheck this and click on next and this is where our android studio is going to, going to be installed fine click on next android studio click on install and there you go our installation has rightly began so i'll wait for a couple of minutes to get it installed and then i'm going to come back so welcome back and now you can clearly see that our android studio is rightly installed so you can just simply click on next so start android studio click on finish and it's going to start our android studio so you can see latest version of android studio the flamingo version is rightly started launching so here you click on do not import settings because we are you know installing android studio for the first time so just simply click on ok so you can click on you know send uh, user statistics to google totally fine just simply click on next and here i'll be recommend you to you know click on custom installation okay and click on next so this is where our you know java development kit and gradle is going to use on this directory totally fine click on next and uh, this is you know uh, your choice like what type of theme you'd like to use i'll choose dracula and proceed and here you need to uncheck this android virtual device as i have mentioned we are going to you know use our own android phone in order to you know uh, run uh, our uh, Android application so no need to use a virtual device so I'll simply uncheck that and click on next so next to proceed this is what all that going to be installed click on next and here you need to accept this license agreement click on accept and click on finish and you can see it has you know rightly started you know downloading all the files and then subsequently it's going to install so welcome back and as you can see it is rightly you know downloaded and installed you can just simply, uh, click on finish so welcome to android studio just simply click on new project and from here you can choose empty activity click on next and here you can give your project name so let's give the project name as hello world and you can see package is also automatically set as uh, com.example.hello world in com and example you can change it with your company name okay so let's say for uh, geeky script i'm going to ch uh, I, I can change this with geeky script right for now i'm going to keep this default 
and this is our minimum SDK version. So all the Android phones which are having Android uh, version 7, uh, 7 7.2 and above are eligible for this new app. Okay, so that uh, that is what it's showing that 94.4 percent of the devices uh, on those devices about this Hello World app is going to be supported, right? So just simply click on finish and you can see our project is rightly started creating. So currently is scanning the files to index. So let's wait for you know a couple of minutes to get it finished. And uh, here you can see that our project is almost open. So here is our latest new Flamingo version. So what new you can always read this from this article. For now I'm going to you know minimize this and I'll wait for some time to finish loading of our project. So in this left panel, you're going to see all the files and folders. So it's currently showing loading. So it will take some time to get it, you know, uh, loaded over here. So here you can see it's currently building the model. So after a couple of minutes, I'll be again coming back to this video. And you can see that our project is, you know, now properly open. So you can see all files and folders that are you know included in our hello world project so this is our package so inside that you can see our you know main activity and all so this is our you know main activity code so by default they have created and if you double click on the first fragment you can see this is our first fragment code and uh, our second fragment code is this one so you know it's time to connect our you know phone with uh, with our you know laptop so let's connect that so first you need to go to your settings on your phone and here you need to go to basically your about phone section and then you need to you know click on this MIUI version so depending upon what brand phone you are using you need to basically click on that version so just you know simply uh, keep on clicking and you can see you are now a developer so you can just simply you know go, uh, go back and then scroll down and you will get you know these additional settings and uh, you will get this you know developer options over here so just simply open that and uh, you can see this USB debugging option so this is what you need to enable so here you need to just simply click on ok accept this and click on ok and there you go now all you need to do is just simply connect you know the USB with your phone and uh, your laptop or desktop whatever you are using just simply connect that and here you need to just simply click on OK, USB debugging and here you need to click on file transfer. Okay, once you do all that, you need to click on turn on. Once you do all that, on your, you know, Android Studio, you will be able to see your device over here. See, our device is rightly shown over here. So now you can just, you know, simply click on this run app button and it will going to start building our project and it going to, you know, install our app on our phone. And you can see that our app is rightly installed and it has automatically launched. So it is currently showing hello first fragment. And when you click on next, it's going to show the second fragment. Okay. So in this way, you can easily install latest version of Android Studio. That is Android Studio version Flamingo on the Windows operating system. And after that, I have also shown you how you can easily run a simple Android project on our Android phone. So that's basically all about this video. If you like the video then please give it a like and also do subscribe our channel that will really help me to make more such videos. So thank you very much for watching this video and God bless you all.